There is a community whose technology needs have been seriously underserved. Cats. In this episode of Upgrade Your Life, apps for cats. What are the options? Do cats even like apps? And will the cat's claws scratch your iPad? First, there are apps for cats? Friskies makes a bunch of apps, including a fishing game. There's this virtual laser pointer app, paint for cats, which brings out your feline's inner artist, and a cat-based piano. We've come to the Tony La Russa Animal Rescue Foundation to see how the cats here respond to the apps. First, I try to entice them with the laser pointer game and the mouse-induced painting game. Not so into it. Okay, new cat. This one really likes the fishing game, but still prefers the old school analog toys. All right, one more cat. This is Tori. She wants to play with just about anything. Now Friskies has just released what they call the first interspecies game. You versus cat. You wanna play? Okay, let's do it. It's kinda like air hockey. I try to flick the chicken wing over to the goal on her side of the iPad. If it goes in, I score. If she bats it anywhere on the screen, she scores. Oh! Oh! Phew, I just won. 30 to 20. It'd be pretty embarrassing to lose to your cat, but cats are proud too. And maybe it's her loss that has her turning up her nose at round two. And my worry, would Kitty's claws scratch the screen? Good news here. Looks like the screen can handle it. Now you may be asking yourself, does my cat need an iPad? True, your cat will not be developmentally stilted or shunned by its peers on the playground if it doesn't have apps and an iPad. Bottom line on apps for cats, well, some of the cats like them. I thought they were fun, but all of the cats like the good old physical toys and the ever popular laser pointer much more than the actual apps. So thanks for watching. For Yahoo News, I'm Becky Worley.